we know that telemedicine at this moment is being used very casually. And I think we are not really so sure about the data privacy and security issues in our country. And I'm going to invite Colonel Verma, who has moved from defense into health. And uh, I don't think that, that there is a better analogy. I think the healthcare data needs as much security as uh, our defense does. Colonel Verma, uh, can I invite you, please? Greetings to all the attendees and uh, thanks to Cowtech 2020 to invite me to share my views here. It's always a great pleasure to share what I really feel passionate about. Now, but before I go any further, you know, a very big salute to all of you in the healthcare sector for, you know, for your dedication and service during these times. You know, in the army, we call it uh, in the face of danger. When you know that bullets are flying, when you know that there's real danger, that is when, when, what do you do? That is when this is a real uh, de depiction of courage and you all are doing a fantastic job. Thank you very much. Now, coming to the subject, <clears throat> in March this year, firstly, I did not know that uh, Mr. Abhishek was behind this, uh, the uh, telemedicine guidelines and it is such a pleasure to hear it from his, uh, from himself. You know, when it came up, the security community with which whom I interact, uh, they gave a pretty uh, predictable reaction actually. Uh, and you know, it was expected from them, you know, um, but all of us who have been waiting for any kind of formal document uh, for telemedicine, we know that it is a welcome. It's a welcome document, whatever it is. Okay, but just, just to see from the point of view of security the community, See, the term security figures only twice in the entire guide. And that too in the background, it's only on the second page it comes twice on the same page and that's it. The term cyber is zero. Uh, the word privacy, thankfully here, it, uh, it figures 10 times. And the word confidentiality appears six times, but all of, of, all of it along with privacy. So clearly here, there's an indication that uh, these aspects is not the prime agenda. But, but uh, we, we know that it's the first step. You see, it mentions that the principles of medical ethics, including professional norms of protecting patient privacy and confidentiality as per the IMC Act should be binding and should be upheld. Okay, it also clearly says that IT Act 2000 and IT Rules 2011 is applicable. It also says that in India, there is no legislation or guidelines on practice of telemedicine. And hence, you know, this is, our, this is only the first step. So, if, if I try to be in the shoes of Mr. Abhishek, I'll tell you, you have done a very good job, frankly speaking. You know, we understand better, uh, we, we understand it when we know that what is the background that you have? Do you have any rules and regulations in India so far? No. Do we have a, 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 a personal pro data protection bill so far? No. So it's a very good, it's a very good first step. And, uh, you know, it can be seen as a parallel it's a first step taken by a child. I don't expect him to start running the first day, but the future definitely looks good. And if you just refer to the documents that I followed, you know, that national data, digital health mission, the, uh, the uh, health data management policy, which has come, the national digital health blueprint, which has come, the uh, discussions on national health stack, which is there, and combined with the uh, forthcoming uh, PDP bill, which unfortunately could not uh, be passed in the, uh, just the concluded, Parliament session, but it is definitely will be there in the winter session. The future looks good, I must say. The first step has been taken and the future looks good. That's all I have to add to this. Thank you, Colonel Verma. And uh, I am sure that you will be playing a major role in enhancing the features related to data security and privacy and confidentiality, which is so important in healthcare. I'll be happy to, thank you. Yeah.